Good evening, I'm going to be sharing with you daily meditations with St. Augustine. It's 11 minutes past 7 and I'm supposed to be in the lounge, but I'll be there when I finish this. We're having a Heach and Wives meeting. It's only um, second, second Monday of the month. So it's not all the time. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Prayer to my guardian angel. O angel of God, my guardian dear, to whom God's love commits me here, ever this night be at my side, to light to God, to rule and guide. Amen. Prayer to Saint Michael the Archangel. Defend us in the day of battle. Be our safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do you, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the other evil spirits who prowl through the world, seeking the ruin of souls. Amen. The meditation for Monday 14th is... A heading as usual and this one says God is not displeased with what he has made God was displeased with our lives and he was displeased with everything we were making of ourselves but he was not displeased with what he had made in us. So he will condemn what we have made and what he has made he will save. He will condemn our evil deeds and save us in ourselves. The prayer. Let everyone who has the aptitude Listen to your word within. How magnificent are your works, O Lord. In wisdom, you have created all things. Uh, the prayer attributed to Saint Augustine. Breathe into me, Holy Spirit, that my thoughts may all be holy. Move in me, Holy Spirit, that my work too may be holy. Attract my heart, Holy Spirit, that I may love only what is holy. Strengthen me, Holy Spirit, that I may defend all that is holy. Protect me, Holy Spirit, that I always may be holy. And I make that prayer for all my followers, and I cannot name them all now. God bless you. You know who you are. I'm going to share the, the readings for uh, Monday night, Monday evening. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Evening praise for the light. O joyful light of the holy glory of the immortal Father, heavenly, holy, blessed Jesus Christ, now that we have come to the sun's hour of rest, the lights of evening round us shine. We praise the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, one God. Worthy are you, O Lord, at all times to be praised with undefiled tongue. O Son of God, O giver of life, therefore you are glorified throughout the universe. Revelations 21.3 and I heard a loud voice from the throne, saying, See, the home of God is among mortals. A reading from Psalm 26, the first part. The Lord is my light and my help. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Before whom shall I shrink? When evildoers draw near, to devour my flesh. It is they, my enemies and foes, who stumble and fall. Though an army encamp against me, my heart would not fear. Though war break out against me, 
even then I would trust. There is one thing I ask of the Lord, for this I long, to live in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to savour the sweetness of the Lord, to behold his temple, for there he keeps me safe in his tent in the day of evil. He hides me in the shelter of his tent. On a rock he sets me safe. And now my head shall be raised above my foes who surround me. And I shall offer within his tent a sacrifice of joy. I will sing and make music for the Lord. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The scripture reading is from Romans eight twenty six to 28. The Spirit helps us in our weakness, for we do not know how to pray as we ought. But that very Spirit intercedes with sighs too deep for words, and God who searches the heart knows what is the mind of the Spirit, because the Spirit intercedes for the saints according to the will of God. God's greatest gifts fall into hearts that are empty of self, St. John of the Cross. A reading of the Canticle of Mary the Magnificat, Luke 1, 46-55. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Saviour, for he has looked with favour on his lowly servant, and from this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and has sent the rich away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children for ever. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The Invocations Lord Jesus, grant that the whole world may be saved. Bring all people to the knowledge of your truth. Lord, in your kindness, Be with the poor and weak. Bring them the help of your comfort. Lord, bring your healing to the sick. Give food and drink to the hungry and thirsty. And together we will pray the Lord's Prayer in both English and Latin. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Pater noster qui es in caelis, sanctificetur nomen tuum, adveniat regnum tuum, Fiat voluntas tua sicut in caelo et in terra, panem nostrum quotidianum da nobis odi et dimite nobis debeta nostra, sicut et nos dimitus debitoribus nostri, et ne nos inducus in tentationem, sed libera nos amalo. The Hail Mary, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. 
Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventri tui, Jesus. Sac Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, ora pro nobis peccadoribus nunc, et in ora mortis nostri. Amen. Concluding Prayer In the peace of the evening we come to you, Lord God. May your word free our hearts from the cares of this day. As we experience your forgiveness in Jesus, may we too forgive in him our brothers and sisters who have injured us. We ask this in his name, Jesus the Christ, our Lord. Amen. May God the Father and the Son bless us in the unity of the Holy Spirit. Amen. May the souls of the faithful departed through the mercy of God rest in peace. Amen. And may the saints of the day pray for us. Amen. And uh, today's saint is St. Lawrence O'Toole of Ireland, 1180. God bless you all. Thank you so much for listening. I'm sending you his peace in abundance and may you always be happy and joyful in the Lord. And uh, it is 7.23, so I'm going to say good night. and if I can quickly upload this, I might not write anything, but I might just upload it and add it later, if I have remembered. God bless, sending you the peace of Christ, and always be happy and joyful in the Lord. God bless the rest of your evening. Bye-bye.